Hey, what's going on, ladies and gents? It's your friend, Neighborhood Content Creator. All right, we have Yunjin here, and she looks actually pretty good. We're going to be having first impression here. I'm not quite sure how her actual kit works, but here we are anyways. She's level out of 80 out of 80. Her attack is at 1,000, defense at 1,700. She has the prototype star glitter. I'm pretty sure you can get away with the catch that would actually perform better than this weapon. Um... You have the Husk of Opulent Dreams here, Constellations at zero, and I'm not quite sure how she works, but for sure she has a counter for elemental skill. Um, this is similar to what you see from Beidou, but except if you exactly time it perfectly or perfectly, she's going to do it automatically instead of releasing. So that's interesting as well. Um, I'm not. Sh she gets a shield, I guess. That's pretty interesting. Um. This is where her meat is, the talent for the elemental burst. So once you use your elemental burst, obviously you're going to do AoE damage. However, this is the important stuff here, the flying cloud flag. You get normal attack bonus, or just bonus damage, I guess. It's based on Yunjin's current defense, so you're going to need a lot of defense on her. The effects of the skill will be cleared after the duration, or a, if it triggered a specific number of times. Okay, so she gets a 51% defense increase at level 8. So, I think it's pretty good. She has an energy cost of 60. Uh, let's see her talents. Oh, there it is. Uh, using the precise time, you get, you know, it just fully uses the level 2. Uh, normal attack damage bonus granted by this is further increased by 2.55 and up to 11.5% of Yunja's defense when the party contains characters of 4 elemental types. Wow, so you can have like... A completely different elemental type team you get an 11.5 percent increase and currently we only have two of the same types wow okay um yeah let's just do it let's just see how she works so we're going to try to like perfect counter not not quite perfect counter but all right we're just gonna do some attacks here to gain some buffs um not to gain some buffs, just to like see the damage all right I didn't perfect counter there, but she just gets just two particles from that. All right, we use that. All right, let's try to counter. That wasn't a perfect counter, but here we are still. All right, all right, let's let's hold the counter this time. And damn it! Ooh, he he pushes them off pretty far. That's pretty interesting, I guess. All right, let's try one more time. We got the Geo buff, we're gonna use her thing, and then we're gonna use Noel to do some damage, right? Uh, I'm not quite sure if it's doing bonus damage or not. I don't know if it affects elemental burst damage hits. Like, maybe similar to the Raiden Shogun. But, okay. Let's see. She's doing 300, 400 sometimes. 600. But, if we use this... She's doing 700, 800. Oh, okay, I see. So it's not like an additional damage. It sort of just adds on to it, in a sense. Like it's not separate, it just adds on to the total damage done. Alright. Alright, that's pretty interesting. I'm assuming just using a different character, like maybe Eula would be actually pretty good. Um, maybe a character like... Uh, maybe Child. Child could be good, right? Unless that's considered elemental damage bonus. I'm not really quite sure. But yeah, pretty interesting. Let's see her thing. Okay, charger stack looks normal. Alright. Really hope she's better. Uh, I don't I'm not quite sure if she is really that good. Alright, maybe I'm judging her too quickly. Let's try again. Let's try one more time. Let's try one more time. I think I can do better. Okay. That's 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 not quite the thing I wanted to do. Uh, <laughs> sorry about that, guys. Okay, let's head back to her thing. At least I got my ultimate back this way. Okay, actually I didn't. I kind of like. All right, let's, let's just do the full thing here. We get three particles instead, which is pretty good. Here we go. Try this again. I guess it's just almost always worth to hold. Your cooldown isn't that bad. Okay. 
And then we use the elemental burst. Alright, I need to see the elemental burst without the shield thing. So she's doing it on 406. Obviously with charge attacks, so it doesn't like, apply on charge attacks. It just does it on the normal attacks. Alright. Alright, let's try to get... Um, let's try to get Noel's burst here. And I'm gonna use it... I'm gonna use it without her... Her buff. So here we go. Get 4k. 4,500 almost. But, I use this, and then go back to her. Oh, 5k! Okay! <laughs> okay, that makes a little more sense. There's that, that's how it works. Okay, that makes way more sense. That makes, that makes way, way more sense. Alright. Yeah, just... I think it would always be necessary for you guys to fully use the level 2 attack on her elemental skill almost always even if you get the perfect count or whatever sometimes you mistime it but i think you should just hold it anyway but yeah that's that's pretty decent um yeah that's really really good okay uh, i i'm curious to see how eula would perform with her or maybe a character like a uh, child even so we're going to uh, try to get her and make a few videos with her but that's gonna be it from me for now thank you guys so much for watching this video hopefully you guys did enjoy if you did consider liking this video subscribe to the channel this is my first impression so far i'm pretty interested on how this character works and i'm kind of excited to see what kind of team compositions people come up with and um I'll, i'm gonna be trying a few myself so thank you guys so much for watching see you guys in the next video very soon Bye bye